This is Tanya. I teach CBSC 10th Max. This is Tina. I teach CBSC 8th Max. All right. Now let's jump into the video. Today we are going to be learning Chapter 8, Introduction to Trigonometry, Exercise 8.4, Fifth Question, Ninth Subdivision. All right. Now let's read the question. Cosecant a minus sine a secant a minus cos a is equal to 1 by tan a plus cot a. So, this is the fifth, ninth subdivision. I am sorry, this is the ninth subdivision. Okay, so now we are supposed to show that LHS is equal to RHS. Okay, so here we are supposed to solve them separately. Okay, so for that, now let us solve this part. So, here first we have cosecant a minus sin a and brackets secant a minus cos a. So, how to solve it? So, since we have cosecant a, we have a formula that is cosecant a is equal to 1 by sin a. This is a formula, isn't it? So, bracket is also important and then minus. Okay, so next uh, we wrote the minus sign as it is. Now, we have sin a. So, we can write the sin a as it is. Okay and close the bracket and then here we have a bracket let us put the bracket as it is and we have secant a so secant a we have a formula that is 1 by cos a and then minus this cos a as it is and close the bracket so here is equal to okay so now what we can do is here nothing is there means it will come 1 here also nothing is there means it is 1 so, is equal to when we just take LCM, we will get 1 minus sin square A divided by sin A. Okay, brackets and then here also bracket. So, when we just take LCM here, we will get 1 minus cos square A divided by cos A. And of course, the brackets are important. Okay, so now uh, when you just look at it carefully, we can actually apply identities. Okay, so what are the identities? So here we have one minus sine square a. So do you guys remember the first identity that is sine square a plus cos square a is equal to one. So here, uh, if I write cos square a is equal to one minus sine square a, isn't it? We can actually abstract the uh, values like this. And sin square a is equal to 1 minus cos square a. Okay, so these are the identities. So here in in instead of these uh, 1 minus sin square a and here 1 minus cos square a, you know. So here we can actually apply the identities. So let us write is equal to bracket and 1 minus sin square a. So I am going to apply this identity. Okay, so 1 minus sin square a is equal to cos square a. So cos square a divided by sin a close the bracket and bracket 1 minus cos square a so here also we can actually apply the identity we will get sin square a so sin square a divided by cos a ok so here when you just look at it carefully uh, we can actually cancel it so how to cancel guys so here we have square so one second yeah Okay, so here we have cos square a and here we have cos a. So we can cancel in this square now, we cancelled one cos a. So here also sin a and here we have square. So here also we can cancel it. After cancelling it, we will get one second, I will show that. Okay, so we will get cos a. We cancelled it, right? Here since we had square, we have remaining one. Here also since we have square, we, we have remaining one. So we will get cos a into sin a. Okay, so now let us solve this one. Okay, that is 1 by tan a plus cot a. Okay, guys, so I just wrote it separately here, then only it will be easy for us to solve. Okay, all right, so now we can write is equal to 1 divided by, so in the place of tan a, we can apply the formula that is sin a by cos a, and then plus, so in the place of cot a, we can apply the formula that is cos a by sin a okay so now what we can do is now we can write is equal to so here we can actually take lcm so 1 divided by when we just take lcm we will get sin square a plus cos square a and divided by 
cos a sin a okay so like this will get when we just take lcm one second okay so now when you just look at it carefully so we here we can actually apply identity that is sin square a plus cos square a is equal to 1 this is the first identity isn't it so we can actually apply this identity so is equal to this one as it is and divided by so here sin square a plus cos square a when we apply the identity we will get 1 and then divided by cos a into sin a as it is okay so now is equal to one second is equal to when we just take reciprocal we will get cos a sin a so now finally we got the same answer so when you just check it out in the first portion no here we got cos a uh, into sin a here also we got cos a into sin a that mean lhs is equal to rhs isn't it okay so so this is the lhs part and these are the rhs part okay so i just did separately for your understanding okay all right so finally we solved it thank you guys for watching this video please like this video share it to your friends and subscribe to our youtube channel if you have any doubt comment me in the comment section catch you in the next video bye